Finally tonight, what wouldn't you do for your best friend? Here's Steve Hartman on the road. It takes real tenacity to make it on the U.S. women's sled hockey team. But what sets 36-year-old Christy Gardner apart and what brought us here to Lewiston, Maine, isn't her doggedness. It's her dog. Let's go. This is Moxie, Christy's service dog and her hero. She's absolutely been a lifesaver. You mean that literally? Quite literally. That dog saved my life. There you go, kiddo. Christy, an army vet, lost both her legs after an attack overseas. Good girl. She got Moxie to help with daily tasks. But more importantly, during her darkest days, Christy says her golden retriever was the only thing that stopped her from ending her own life. The way she would just look at you, her eyes would go right through to your soul. And I felt like I was disappointing her. And so having her by my side was the only reason I didn't kill myself. Christy is now much better, but she has felt indebted to her dog ever since. I feel like she deserves so much more. Unfortunately, there is no good way to repay a debt to a dog. You my best buddy. Especially not the magnitude of debt Christy feels she owes Moxie. Which is why, instead of paying it back, she has come up with the sweetest plan to pay it forward. Meet Tiny Tim. He's not just any puppy. He's a puppy like her. I gotta go back to class. Christy has taken Tim and his bum wing under her wing and is now training the pup to be a therapy dog. They're working on manners. Ideally, she'd like him to work full time here at Leeds Elementary, helping kids who feel broken. There's just so much about him that is so perfect for this little mission of his. I think the kids are gonna say, well, he had all these problems and he didn't give up and look how happy he is. But before Tim can be a certified therapy dog, so soft. he needs a surgery to amputate his bad leg. Christy had been working multiple jobs to pay for that until this assembly. A check for $10,000 to pay for all of Ty and Tim's medical expenses. Vetra Science, a pet food supplement company, made the donation, delighting both trainer and trainee. Okay, okay. Looks like Good that boy. debt has been repaid in full. Moxie saves you. You save Tiny Tim. And now Tiny Tim's going to save the town. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Very cool, but also exhausting. Steve Hartman on the road in Lewiston, Maine. Makes you happy, doesn't it? That is the CBS Evening News for this week. I'm Jeff Floor. I will see you next week from Vietnam. Our coverage of the U.S.-North Korean summit begins on Monday. Have a great weekend.